Okay, AWS has loads of different machine learning and AI services, but understanding what each one does and what it can be used for can be a challenge. Like opening a box of chocolates, they might all appear the same at first glance, but they are all very different. Now, if you're preparing for the AWS Certified Cloud Practitioner exam, machine learning services from AWS should be top of mind. And here's my rundown of the machine learning services that you are likely to see in the Cloud Practitioner exam. Number one is Amazon Comprehend. And this is a service that uses natural language processing and machine learning to process text. Now, natural language processing is a way for computers to analyze understand and derive meaning from text. And comprehend can be used to discover meaning, identify key topics and phrases, and even perform sentiment analysis on unstructured text. For example, documents, emails, or web pages. And one example use case is to use comprehend to analyze social media feeds and perform sentiment analysis to discover whether customer sentiment is positive, neutral, or negative. Number two is Amazon Kendra, and Kendra is an intelligent search service that allows you to query your data using natural language. It supports data stored in S3, RDS, or even public websites, or external shared drives like Google Drive, Dropbox, or GitHub. And Kendra supports both unstructured and semi-structured data types like CSVs, HTML, XML, PDFs, or Microsoft Office documents. After providing your data to Kendra, it will then create a searchable index of your data that you can query using natural language instead of having to write any code. So you can ask simple fact-based questions like, what is the deadline for applying security updates? Or descriptive questions like, how do I return a faulty item? And Kendra will retrieve the answers from your data. So this is a really easy way to query your data using natural language. Number three is a service that's used to add chatbot capabilities to your applications, and it's called Amazon Lex. Now, if you've ever interacted with an automated customer service bot online, then you've probably been interacting with Lex. It accepts voice or text input and works with mobile devices, web applications, and chat services like Facebook Messenger. So Lex can be used to create virtual agents to arrange customer refunds, flight changes or password resets, or provide automated responses to frequently asked questions on your website. Number four is Amazon Polly, which uses deep learning to generate natural sounding speech from text that you provide. So it's performing a text to speech service. You can provide the text in a variety of languages and the resulting audio can be streamed or saved as an MP3. So you can use Polly to read out a blog post or a short story, or read the contents of a website to help people who are visually impaired. Or it could be used to provide natural sounding speech for a social media post. Number five is Amazon Recognition. And this is a service that uses machine learning to perform video analysis and image recognition. It uses pre-trained machine learning models to extract information from images and videos, perform facial detection and analysis, as well as object and text detection. Use cases include user identity verification, product and inventory verification, and content moderation by detecting harmful or offensive images. So this is a great way to add automated video and image analysis to your applications. Number six is Amazon SageMaker, and SageMaker is a fully managed machine learning platform that supports your end-to-end -end machine learning workflow. With SageMaker, you can import data from AWS data sources like S3, Athena, Redshift, or Elastic MapReduce, and you can prepare the data as well. For instance, identify potential errors, any data quality issues, or bias in your data, and you can then select a model from one of the built-in machine learning models like MXNet, PyTorch, or TensorFlow, or foundation models for generative AI capabilities. And you can also provide your own custom model. After selecting your model, you can use SageMaker to train the model, and it can even help you with automatic model tuning to help improve model accuracy. And when your model is ready, SageMaker can deploy the model to optimized EC2 instances with specially designed processors that are suitable for machine learning workloads. 
So it's a one-stop shop for your end-to-end -end machine learning workflow, enabling you to build, train, and deploy machine learning models in the cloud. And finally, there's Textract, Transcribe, and Translate. And these are three very similar sounding services that use machine learning to process text. So Amazon Textract is used to extract text data from any kind of document, like PDFs, images, tables, or forms. It could be printed or even handwritten text. For example, it could be used to verify identity documents, like a passport or driving license, for a bank loan application. Amazon Transcribe is a speech-to-text service, so it takes speech or audio as input and transcribes it to text that can be either streamed or stored as an audio file. Use cases include automatically generating subtitles or creating meeting notes. And Amazon Translate is a service that uses machine learning to perform accurate, natural-sounding language translation. It supports over 70 different languages, and you can even customize it to include your own product names, brand names, or your own specific terminology. It supports HTML or text content as input, and use cases include translating product documentation to different languages, or even real-time translation for customer support. And there we have it, all the machine learning services that you will need to know for the AWS Certified Cloud Practitioner exam. Thanks for watching, and if you'd like to take the next step in your tech learning journey, sign up for free tech skills courses below.